actually create a series of workshops. One that works into another and another. Eventually, all three workshops work together, but each workshop is independent. So if you just take the beginner's course or the basic workshop, it is for artists, and this workshop is really the key to the other two workshops. This workshop is for artists who are those artists that are intimidated about being in a workshop, who are afraid that everybody there in the workshop is going to be better than them. It's also for artists that are actually good and they're guessing and they're not quite sure why they're getting good results and why sometimes the results are not good. It's also for them. But the emphasis is on beginning basics. So that when beginning students who want to plain air paint sh show up for class, they don't have to be fearful that they're going to be overrun by all of these professional artists. It really is geared toward the basic concepts. And I was talking with Chris and I was like, so how do we design this? Because it's the entire weekend is script. And we had boiled it down to 12 essential things that you need to do to do powerful paintings outdoors. 12 of them. And in the basics workshop, we go through them one by one, all 12. And we figured that's how many we could actually cover. And that when you leave here, leave our workshop, you will actually know <coughs> the 12 fundamental things you need to know to powerfully paint outdoors. Not by gosh, by golly, but actually have complete knowledge and skills. There are also skills that are important in doing original paintings indoors. So part of them are composition and transitions and lighting and temperature and those, those things, but we've designed it in such a way so that they're in bite size. And we'll be taking all of these individual conversations every day and applying them as we're talking about them and that's all you're going to be doing so that at the end of the workshop you can go aha I might not paint very well but at least know what I want I at least have something to hold on to the plain air workshop or normal plain air workshop is for the artists that know the fundamentals a lot of you know the fundamentals you can come into the plain air workshop and you can work in that now the plain air workshop is based still on the 12 fundamentals that we have because I've broken it down to 12. No more, no less. And in that class, we're going to go to more challenging locations, places that are a little bit more challenging than in the basic workshop. We're going to have a little bit more emphasis on trying to achieve rather than learn. In the first basics workshop, we're trying to learn the basics. In the, the second plein air class, we are going to actually apply them and make sure that we know them. And then we're gonna have an advanced workshop. The advanced workshop is for people who really wanna get out there and paint like crazy. And so hopefully by the time we give the advanced workshop, um, and if we have students that begin from the beginning to the middle to the end, not only are you going to be painting with painters that you're already familiar with when you get to the advanced class, but you're going to know all the fundamentals, you're going to be very comfortable, you're going to shed all of the extra stuff you don't need, and you'll be able to hold yourself um, in, in a way that you are competent in what you do. So therefore, now you can go and sign up for any class in the country and stand up there and actually probably be teaching a lot of the people that are there in class. Because a lot of these fundamental things that I teach in the workshop aren't taught in a lot of workshops. So you will be able to go to a place, be able to paint powerfully, and go to other workshops afterwards and have people actually look over your shoulder and say, wow, how did you come up with that? So the fundamental workshop is going to be fantastic and I'm going to be giving the, the fundamentals workshop, the basic workshop, the plein air workshop, and then the, the more advanced workshop. Um, and then I'm going to repeat them again and again. So if you can't do them here this coming up the next few months, I will be doing the whole series again and the whole series again. So we're going to be doing these, these workshops over and over and over again. If you don't want to do the basics workshop, like the students in this class, you can do the plain air workshop. Now all of the workshops are up in Mount Shasta. We have a campus there. 
So you'll be in the place that I actually teach there. It's a beautiful place. All of the locations will be within a very short distance of there because we want to spend time painting. And then we want to spend time critiquing as we go along. So if you're interested in getting any more information, you can go to stephanbauman.com. As we're developing our, our series, if you're interested in going to any of the plein air workshops, that's the place you want to go. So anyway, go to stephanbauman.com and go into workshops and you'll see all these upcoming workshops. Okay?